I just had a full on panic attack. Our flight's canceled. Guys, I don't know what I'm doing. Good morning, afternoon, night, evening. Don't know what time it is. Hey guys, Sadie. Sorry, I'm literally getting my lip gloss out. I have like no time to do this intro. I don't know where to put my camera. Can I put it in my pillow? Yes, I can. I am going to Greece. Today is June 1st, Wednesday. Don't know why I said it in that order. Wednesday, June 1st. I'm leaving for Greece on Friday. My life has been stressful. If you watch my last video, it was basically me emotionally and physically recovering from the last week of my life because I had a very stressful and emotionally draining week. There was just drama and there was just stuff that happened that I was going through. I didn't have any time to really prepare for this trip. Yeah, I really don't travel that often. I'm going to Greece with my dad on Friday and I'll explain kind of like the whole plan for us, but it is 12.07 right now and I have a nail appointment with my mom at 12.30. I don't even know if I like my outfit. I'm on my period and I just wanted to wear like my literal period shorts and this top is from Garage, but I just like my hair back and I feel like really like I am ready to prepare because I've been pushing off preparing for so long that there's literally no time left to not prepare. I need to like call my bank today. I need to like buy stuff for the trip. I need to get like myself ready for the trip because I usually can't film these like in the summer because I literally don't go anywhere. But now I finally can film a like prep for my trip with me video. Mom, are you ready? Did I put these earrings in? Oh, right. Okay, she used to remind me to wear flip flops. I was literally gonna wear socks and sneakers. Okay. <laughs> what color are you gonna get? White with the pink under top. That's literally exactly what I was gonna get. You copied me. Cause like I feel like there's no use in just refilling in the exact same color. You know what I mean? Cause then it's just like, he doesn't feel like they're new. The clip just before this, I was like, guys, we have to rush, we have to rush, it's 12.30. <laughs> so I made a little mistake. I thought that our appointment's at 12.30, but it's actually at 1.30. So now it's 12.30, we don't know what to do. So we're going to go to a mall that is kind of near here and we're going to maybe get some food. My blood sugars are going a little bit low. So I might get a little smoothie. But it's just funny because I was literally rushing out the door. Like I was like, oh, we have to go here, let's go. We have an hour. But it's like, it's not enough time to like go home and then come back. I also might want to take a little Instagram. Or a big Instagram. Or a big one, like a medium size. Mango magic. It has kale, mango, pineapple. Oh, oh, I literally like that one better. We're going to shoppers. Having diabetes 101. <laughs> Taking needles in the shoppers drug mart. <laughs> Pharmacy is a good place to take drugs. Yeah, it actually is. I have to buy tubs of glucose. Um, he bought that, I believe. Body sunscreen, Tylenol, and I need to buy SD cards. Sun bum. I don't think this is that natural, but it's only two weeks. 50 SPF. There's literally a thing that goes like up your butt in this chair, like a massage thing. <laughs> gonna get my pedicure and my manicure at the same time but then she said that we couldn't do that I just booked my manicure my refill for tomorrow morning today I'm just gonna go home literally pack everything that I can so tomorrow it's just like last-minute stuff and then maybe doing a little bit of errands okay the way that I'm kind of organizing myself for this trip, I have a little Google Sheet, which I'm going to pull up. I made this Google Sheet by myself. Like I didn't take a template or anything, but I did actually look up on Pinterest, just some ideas to like put on the sheet. Clothes, accessories, shoes, toiletries, diabetes, tech, other, food, and to-do. And it's a pretty big list. I've been stressed about packing clothes, but I don't even think it's gonna be that difficult. Like you just bring some shorts, bring some tops, bring some dresses, and then under things. And that's it. What sucks is that I forgot to do laundry. So I'm doing laundry right now, so I might forget some of the things that are in the wash. I'm packing like a medium sized suitcase. I'm not bringing my own, like the pink one that I have, like that I brought to LA and everything. Cause I need a bigger one. I made myself a coffee for the occasion. Cause it's like rainy outside. It's really thunderstorming. Perfect. Perfect. Which is actually fine because it's gonna break up the humidity, but I needed some liquid inspiration. <laughs> okay. I don't even know where to start. <laughs> okay. So I'm going for 14 days. So I'm just gonna start with shorts. Can't go wrong with shorts. These type, guys, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm gonna need denim shorts. These two look the same. 
So I'm gonna bring these. I need black. Oh, should I bring the ones I'm wearing? I definitely should. Great. Should I bring these or ripped? I'll actually say both. Look at that foam, guys. T-shirts and tank tops. Basic white button-up. Basic white whatever this is. Okay. Ooh, because it's grease, we need a lot of blue. And this one, I'm gonna bring just a regular black crop top. My camera died. Seven, eight. That's already eight. That's a lot. I just bought this shirt from Blue Notes, specifically just for like bathing suit cover up. I'm gonna bring this shirt. It's giving Grinch, but like the cute version. I'm gonna bring this one shoulder shirt if we go out for dinner or something. I think it's kind of fancy. Guys, my head is like spinning. Oh, I already know I'm bringing these. Aritzia Mega Sweatpants. Best sweatpants I own. Also, if I'm gonna work out, then I'm probably also gonna bring some biker shorts, leggings, jeans, sweatpants. I need a hoodie. I'm gonna bring this Shadow Hill one. I'm gonna bring my orange shorts for the occasion. I literally forgot all of these super cute tops. I have like this button up top, this cutie little red one. Dress it. I'm bringing her. Then I'm bringing this one because it just gives me grease. Okay, and these two. Guys, I'm literally not gonna have any room. I'm gonna bring this skirt. I don't know if it's worth it. I might not eventually. The shoes that I'm bringing are literally just these Havanas, I think they're called. These are like the only flip-flops I like for some reason. This is where we're at. I think it's all gonna fit, but I also could be way overpacking or underpacking. I still need to pack socks, underwear. Oh my god, swimsuits, shorts to wear under dresses, pajamas, sports bras, and period underwear. They're I won't be needing for too long. Question, do I bring these sunglasses or these ones? I kind of want to bring these. This is literally chaos. Guys, I'm stressed. I I actually just packed basically all of my clothes, which is actually really good. I feel really good about that. Tomorrow, I'm gonna pack my skincare, makeup, just all of my like toiletry stuff, and then random stuff and like stuff that just goes in my carry-on and all my tech stuff um, for filming and editing and stuff. How many times can I say stuff? I actually. Every single time that I go on vacation, I make a last minute list. So I just made like a last minute list in my reminders of just like stuff I need to pack. Like insulin because that needs to stay cold. And then my purse, empty my SD cards. I need to buy some stuff. So tomorrow's honestly gonna be a pretty packed day too. Also the thing is, like the reason why this is so kind of stressful is because my mom is leaving on vacation too tomorrow. Everyone's just, everything's everywhere. Like my mom is going with my sister and then my dad's like joining them and then my brother's going with my cousin in some other place and then I'm coming home with my dad and then my dad's gonna like meet my sister and my mom in Nova Scotia and then I'm gonna be staying at my sister's apartment while they're away like taking care of her cat just so many things are going on and there's like on top of everything else that I have to deal with in my life right now but I'm like really happy that I'm filming this process because I'm gonna remember like remember that time when I was packing for Greece and I was so stressed and I was also on my period and I was like so sensitive like, I'm actually going to take this time to zen myself, maybe plan a little bit of content and make sure that all of my batteries are charged for tomorrow too, like when I film the process. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I have zero time to be drinking this coffee right now. Oh my god, it's so hard to charge, charge, charge. It's so hard to charge. It's so hard to charge. I am... Heading to my nail appointment now. I'm late. My alarm went off at 8 instead of 7.30. Okay, I'm just gonna go. Get my little man is done. I got him done. Is this in fro- fro- okay. I got a very pink toned white, so it's like kind of off-white, but in a pink way. <laughs> I literally said, I want a white, but that's like slightly pink. And she picked it out of the thing and I was like, yeah. And she actually did them so fast. She did them in like 45 minutes. I need to call my pharmacy because I realized I don't think I have enough insulin pen tips to go on this trip. Always like the rule of thumb is to pack double the diabetes supplies that you need to go on a trip or like medical supplies. So I'm gonna call her, call my little pharmacy girl and see if I can pick some up today. And I'm just wondering if I could get an extra box of pen tips. Yeah, you can get. Okay, I'm gonna fill another two boxes for you. Oh, okay, great. You can pick up today. You can pick up anytime. I have it in stock. Okay, awesome. Thank you. I don't know why I'm wearing sweatpants and a, a sweatshirt. There's just so much going on in my like personal life too that I'm in shambles. But it's kind of funny. 
I just got my pen tips. I actually just came home so that I could change into a tank top. I was sweating through my shirt. It was really cold in the morning and then now it just got really hot and humid. So I picked up my pen tips. She actually gave me two boxes and I was like, so nice of you. I need to get SD card, glucose, and lip balm. And that's it. I could probably get all of those at Walmart. Okay, I'm gonna, I'll, see, I'll see you there. It's also really scary because when I was walking out of Walmart, the like alarm went off. So that was kind of weird. And it went off and then it went off again. And I was like, God, I'm literally stocked now. And then I also got this massive SD card. I think I got a package. I have no idea what this is. I've never heard of this brand before. Oh, this is this is like an essential oil. I love essential oils, guys. I was just thinking, I rarely use my diffuser over there, my like essential oil diffuser, because it's so far away. You have to like take it and fill it up with water and then put it back and plug it in, and it's just too far away for me to do that. So I never use it, but I'm so excited for when I go to uni and I can just have it like on my desk and I'll actually use it because I love essential oils. I think they actually change my mood. Then we have this really fancy packaging. What? I feel like I'm holding like a perfume. Ultimate power infusing concentrate. And then I got a hand moisturizer. Look at this packaging. Thank you, Shiseido, for sending me these. Oh, 40 30. Pounds. Okay. Things that I've done since we last talked. One, I got my SIM card set up, which means I can have data in Grace. And I put a travel notice on all of my cards. I have my outfit set up right here for tomorrow for the airport. And now I'm editing. I am actually trying to finish this video and make the thumbnail, get everything done. So that tomorrow when I'm like in the airport and stuff, I don't have to even worry about getting my video up. I just want to have it like ready. Yeah, and I think I actually decided I'm going to film going to the airport and actually traveling because I feel like I want to also kind of document that too. Today's the day, right? leave for Greece and I thought I would do a little what's in my carry-on because I'm literally only bringing this bag. This is actually like my school bag. If you guys remember, I did like a what's in my backpack video. I feel like I look so clean today. Just today out of all days, like I don't think I've ever looked like this like clean. Like I feel very clean girl. Today my dad and I drove and we got some coffee this morning, but this is what is in my carry-on. I have my purse. I'm just bringing my purse because I want to have a purse there. Inside my purse is fun stuff. A protein bar just in case I get snackish this isn't actually vitamin d but i have it in a vitamin d container but it's my vitex pills because i don't want to like not take them on the trip lip gloss hair ties tampons my wallet which is basically nothing in it i have all of my makeup in here the makeup that i did today um this is like my little airport makeup tutorial moisturizer sunscreen because i know that when you fly your face like sucks up a bunch of oil i really want it to be moisturized and then i'm also going to be wearing a mask the whole time so i really don't really care the only reason why i was going to put makeup on is because i wanted to take photos in the airport but now i don't really care i brushed up my eyebrows oh i was gonna do mascara and then i just did setting spray you know what i'll do mascara but i'll put it on after i have my brushes separate because when i'm doing my makeup i don't like having like constantly reach for the brushes and the makeup brushes all of my electronic stuff like my chargers I'm gonna put my laptop in there, but right now I'm using it. I have this, which is not hand sanitizer. It's in a hand sanitizer bottle, but I use this to clean my piercings. And I put it in a spray bottle so that I could spray it. But now I just use a Q-tip because I feel like spraying it doesn't really get inside. Then gum, extra camera batteries, and then I have some hair ties. Obviously my AirPods fully charged. I actually remember to charge them. Lip gloss at the ready. A pen and a pencil, which I didn't even pack and was already in there. Guys, this is gonna be the bag that I use for university. Wait, do people use backpacks in university still? I think they do. Honestly, I don't know. I feel like they all use those little cute bags, but now I don't know if they do. Maybe they use those. Okay, not not the point. Oh, and then I also have my insulin, which probably should be good to take. I'm not taking my planner because there's literally no room. And then I have my cute little neck below. Sharps. I have a video to edit, so I'm gonna do this. I 
asked you on my Instagram how to order an iced almond milk latte because I knew I would be doing that a ton. And a Creo latte me gala amigdalu. Paracalo. But also, everyone told me to try a Fredo Cappuccino Metrio. What's Metrio? I think that's medium. Oh. Medium. Fredo latte with almond milk. Fredo. So, Fredo's iced. Update. It's 9.27 p.m. Our flight was supposed to leave at 6.30 and then it got delayed and then it got delayed and then it got delayed and now I think it's canceled. So... But we did get another coffee though. Actually, I got a black coffee because they didn't have almond milk there. And they also didn't have lattes. So I was like, what do you have? So I just got a black coffee. But I don't really know what we're going to do now. That means we're going to miss like our connecting flight and then maybe miss the ferry to Paros. Hey, France. Yeah, everybody left. Oh. But they were... Our flight's canceled. canceled. Yeah, so do they not tell you? Well, they told whoever was here. No, I mean, like, do they not tell you any other option of any other flight, like, ever? Oh, no, they will. Whoever oh. went to the hotel will be notified. back at the airport it's the next day our flight this morning got delayed an hour and 45 so now we're on the phone with air canada trying to figure out if we can get our connecting flight because like it already delayed an hour and 45 which means we would have missed our another connecting flight which now we're flying to vienna and then flying to athens and then getting our ferry there's been so many things that are like behind the scenes i need coffee look at my bags look at that i just want to like sit down and edit and eat i got sushi though that's really good That is so good. Blueberries, blackberries, pear, and apple. So I just had a full on panic attack. We landed it in Vienna. This is like our layover for like three hours. I had a full on panic attack. I was crying and shaking, and I don't I don't think I've ever had a panic attack before. So if that is what it is, anyone who goes through that on a daily basis, oh my gosh, what? I'm like still trying to recover from it. I'm like shaking. So what happened is I have a little bit of a medical thing that is happening that I don't really want to like talk about. I do need need like medication for it and it's really good to start taking the medication as soon as possible when you notice symptoms but I don't have the medication and you need a prescription for it and I don't have a prescription and obviously we're in the Vienna airport trying to catch another flight so we need to like get to Athens so that we can get to a doctor to get a prescription so then we were calling our family that we have in Athens to see if they could get like a prescription for us so that they could like find the drug I lost my appetite <laughs> then I was also drinking a hot coffee so I was like sweating through my shirt but now I'm like freezing that's the update but our flight boards in like three hours the smoothie is really good though no I actually did film myself I got one clip of me after I had my mental breakdown on my iPhone which I probably inserted before this or maybe I'll insert it now It was actually pretty funny because like I was trying so hard not to cry. We made it to my relative's house and we're just staying here for one night. And then today I'm actually starting a new vlog because we are taking the ferry to the island. But yeah, that's going to be this travel video. It was kind of crazy. Thank you for staying till the end if you did. Tell me if you say it to the end because it's literally insane. This was like the most insane travel process I've ever been through. Thank you so much for watching. I love you so much. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.